In this video, we'll show you how to fix the gallery app keeps stopping error on your Samsung phone quickly and easily. If your gallery keeps crashing and won't open, I'll guide you through the simple steps to get it working smoothly once again. Let's jump right into it. Solution 1. Clear the gallery app cache. So for this to happen, you need to go to your Samsung phone settings and then scroll down and find apps. Once you find apps, tap on it and then find the gallery app from here. If you cannot find it, then what you can do is just search for it. Just open the search bar and search for gallery and it should show up. So open this up and in here you need to scroll down a bit and find storage. So just tap on storage and choose clear cache and you can also choose clear data, but that might also delete all your photos. So don't do that. Just select clear cache. And after that, simply restart your phone. Hold the power button and then give your phone a simple restart and see if that fixes your problem or not. In most cases, the problem gets fixed at this point, but if the issue persists, then you can try the other solutions. Solution two, check for software update. So go to your phone settings, scroll down and find software update from here and tap on it. If you have any software updates available, you will see a red dot in the top for download and install. So you need to download and install any latest software is available. Once you have updated your phone to the latest Samsung OS version or the One UI version, I think that will fix your problem as well. But if that did not fix the problem, then let's try the solutions. Solution 3. Reset all your settings. To do that, you need to go to your settings again, scroll down, tap General Management, and then scroll down once again and find this feature called Reset. Tap on Reset, scroll down once again. Choose Reset all settings and then confirm your choice by tapping Reset settings. After that, select reset again, and that will reset all your settings. See if that fixes the problem. If that does not fix your problem, then you can try the last solution, which will be wiping the cache partition. This will be a bit tricky because it will be outside your phone's OS. So what you need to do is power off your Samsung phone. So hold the power button of your Samsung phone and then power off your Samsung phone. Once your phone has been powered off, you need to go to the side and you'll find the volume button and the power button. So simply press the volume up button and the power button together until you find the bootloader option. So just press and hold on to it. And let's say you can hold on to it for like 10 seconds. Eventually it will show up. So this is what I call the bootloader option. Let me put my phone a bit close. As you can see, it's called Android recovery mode. And in here, what you need to do is wipe the cache partition. So in this page, you will not be able to use a touch panel. What you need to do is use the volume buttons and the power buttons to navigate. You will need to use the volume up button to go up, the volume down button to go down, and the power button to confirm your action. So from here, you need to tap down, 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 and down again until you find wipe cache partition. So what you need to do is press the power button over here and select wipe cache partition and use the volume button to go down and select yes. As you can see, it will show you something like this, and then you will find the option called Reboot System Now. So let's just say, select this Reboot System Now with the power button, and your phone will now restart. The Samsung logo will now show up, and your phone will restart, and hopefully, after this, your problem will be fixed. So guys, that's how you fix it if your gallery is giving you trouble. Hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, then don't forget to give it a like, and be sure to subscribe to this channel if you want more Samsung-related tutorials. Thanks a lot for watching.